Well, probably the most common one is the B tree, or it's related B plus tree. Uh, this whole issue of having data structures, as I pointed earlier to, to answer your question, is something that's really being re-examined in the face of uh, availability of large amounts of high-speed memory, uh, whether uh, there are other ways to organize data and solve problems than use the traditional uh, structures that have been used. So I'd say it's, a, you know, it's an open area of research whether uh, you, you should maintain large databases the way they're traditionally maintained, whether you should maintain them in a different manner which would allow you to fetch even bigger blocks of data into high-speed memory and then do the searches in memory. So now it is only B-tree? Uh, <coughs> well, I said B-tree is the most common one. And like I said, there are variations of it, like the B star and the B plus tree. Okay. And these are connected by uh, some kind of network. It could be a simple uh, <coughs> forward respective caches, where I've seen in some papers when a data size is larger, some people are applying this fudgy or 